Hi, I'm White C, and you're watching Lady Gun TV. When I'm in collaboration with another artist, um, there's kind of a shared weight. I think that when you're working by yourself and pursuing a solo endeavor, uh, the highs and the lows are all yours to kind of shoulder. So um, I know in my time with ME3, there's like a sense of comfort of uh, knowing that I was helping Anthony and he was also helping myself kind of shoulder the burden of writing or performing live particularly because that's obviously where we spent a lot of our time together. Um, but being by myself now and pursuing White Sea as a solo project, it's kind of it's kind of all up to me. So it's thrilling, but it's also very, very nerve wracking. Um, I finished the tour uh, or the first tour that I did with m 3 for the album Saturdays Equals Youth. And I came back and I knew that I wanted to kind of experiment and try things on my own in the studio and kind of uh, started remixing other artists and got really involved in the production side of things and uh, decided to write an EP and taught myself uh, Pro Tools in the process and just kind of how to be an engineer and a producer. And, um, and yeah, it turned, I turned, I kind of became known almost more at that point for my remixes and then, uh, did this next tour with M83 for Hurry Up We're Dreaming and decided that it was time to start writing an album when I was on the road. So I started crafting songs in the back of the bus and, um, and then finished it when I got home this last summer. So. Um, in M83, it's very, it's a bunch of boys except for myself. So we just kind of like... We go like that. <laughs> um, and then with White Sea, uh, we we just started playing together, so we don't have full rituals yet, but we um, we start by holding each other's hands and we do like a little guided meditation. We each take turns. Sometimes it's silly. Sometimes it's really serious if we're all nervous. And uh, yeah, I have a feeling those traditions are going to probably evolve into something much sillier though. <laughs> Um, it was just kind of the natural next step. I feel like, um, I feel like I was in a place where I was ready to see what I was capable of doing, um, on my own. And it just started happening naturally. It's like, it's a breakup record. So I was feeling the feels <laughs> and we were on tour and it was just, it was, it was very challenging. And the only way for me to kind of get out uh, a lot of how I was feeling was, by putting things down in demos and writing lyrics and just starting to program in the back of the bus. Um, I grew up in a household where we really only listened to like jazz and classical and a lot of musical theater. Uh, so I have a big background in, in, uh, in those areas of music. Um, I did a lot of theater when I was a kid and I played classical piano until about 14 and took up the cello when I was like 16, 17. Um, so my background is very, is very classic. It's not, it's definitely not modern. I'm White C and you've been watching Lady Gun TV. Thank you.